Hey everyone, welcome back to Joystick News. Today, we've got some exciting and frustrating updates from the gaming world, specifically for all you Fallout fans out there. We're diving into the latest news about the Fallout London mod for Fallout 4. If you're a fan of mods or just love the Fallout series, this is a must watch. So let's get right into it. The creators of the Fallout 4 Total Conversion mod, Fallout London, have promised to fix the game's reported technical issues soon. While this mod has been praised for its story and world building, it's currently plagued with crashes that are affecting gameplay for many players. Fallout London was originally announced by the non-profit modding group Team Fallen in 2021 and was recently released on GOG. It's entirely free, but had to be released on GOG because its files were too big for other modding platforms like Nexus Mods. Despite the positive acclaim, many gamers have experienced constant crashes since they started playing it. Team Fallen has thanked the community for their support and promised to fix the reported technical issues. They haven't given an official date for the update yet, but claim that the patch will come out soon. In the meantime, gamers should carefully read the installation instructions before installing the mod to avoid compatibility issues. Using Fallout 4's Buffout 4 mod is also recommended to reduce crashes. At the moment, Fallout London has a score of 3.3 out of 5 on GOG. Considering it's a huge and complex mod made by a non-profit group, the score is likely affected by the many issues gamers have had while playing it. There are multiple comments on the game's page stating that Fallout London crashes all the time, making it unplayable for a significant portion of the user base. PC gamers who want to try out Fallout London can do so if they have GOG or Steam copies of Fallout 4. However, due to the need to downgrade Fallout 4's version for the mod to work, the Epic Games Store version of Fallout 4 is not compatible with Fallout London as the X platform does not give players that option. Unfortunately, there are still no updates from Team Fallen regarding a console release of Fallout London. Team Fallen has previously confirmed that Fallout London won't be available for consoles because its files are too big to be allowed on the console modding platforms. If Bethesda's owner, Microsoft, would make an exception for the game, this could be possible, but it's unlikely to happen. So, what do you think about this news? Are you excited to try Fallout London once the issues are fixed, or are you already experiencing the crashes? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more updates on gaming news. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.